Hi, my name is Juan Infante and I graduated with the class of 2015. Uh, thank you so much for allowing me to share a little bit about myself today. Uh, I didn't expect that going to a school that was uh, far away from home would actually have such a large impact on who I am today. I think that uh, making the decision to go away for college has really allowed me to grow on an emotional level that I I'm not sure would have been possible if I had stayed in Miami. Uh, although leaving home uh, can be very scary and it is certainly very difficult at first. Uh, I think that every student that has the opportunity to do it should absolutely uh, really consider uh, taking it. Living away from home, I think, uh, has really helped me become a much more independent and confident person, uh, which is not to say that you don't need the support of others because you certainly do, but it simply means that you're able to discover more about yourself as a person you really become your own individual and learn more about the things that you are passionate about which i think is always really valuable uh, in college i am involved in uh, several organizations that i wanted to talk a little bit about today uh, first of all i am involved in the executive board of uh, evening with champions uh, we are a nonprofit organization that uh, puts together a figure skating exhibition each year to raise money for the for the Jimmy Fund, which is the fundraising arm of the Dana Farber Cancer Institute in Boston. Uh, I am also on the board of uh, Harvard College Children's Stories. We are a student-run organization that uh, writes and illustrates children's books, and then we donate them to childcare organizations uh, in different countries. And uh, perhaps the most academic activity I'm involved in is that I am an undergraduate researcher at Boston Children's Hospital, where I am working uh, to develop a method for uh, delivering protein therapeutics to the spinal cord in an effort to promote uh, functional action regeneration uh, following spinal cord injuries. In terms of my career, um, my goal is to eventually hopefully enter an MD-PhD program in neuroscience after my undergraduate years. Uh, I hope to become a practicing neurosurgeon who sees patients but who is also involved in clinical research. Uh, and really, I would love to be a part of academia uh, at some point in my career. I've always loved the idea of maybe becoming a professor, so I really hope that one day I'm able to do that. But I also think that a, a word that is often associated with career goals or career accomplishment is success. And I, I think that defining the word success sh uh, should be a very personal exercise and the definition should really be different for everyone. But to me, success really means to, to be able to do something that I really love while also feeling like I am contributing to society in some positive way. So... When I say that I hope to be successful, I really mean that I, I hope I'm able to do something that I feel like there is a, a greater purpose behind it and that I, I enjoy what I do every day. Uh, so thank you so much for allowing me to share a little bit about myself. I, I always really enjoy coming back to Draw College because uh, it was really the stepping stone that allowed me to, to, to do all of these cool things. Uh, it certainly would not have been possible without a, a Draw College education. So thank you very much.